Okay, take three. Five, four, three, two. Hey, everyone, it's me. And uh, I know the discussion here has been getting pretty hard and heavy, talking about guns and the Second Amendment and politics and the beer virus. Well, tonight I'm going to whip out one of my favorite freaking weapons and show it all to you. It's my Gibson Les Paul Money Base. And you are here on MTV News. Wait, no. You're actually on Uncle Robbie's Science Corner, and this whole video is going to get demonetized because I played that riff. But whatever, none of my videos get monetized anyway. So, guys, welcome back to Guitar Porn on Uncle Robbie's Science Corner! Yay! Okay, guys, I know, I know, like, I've been getting heavy. Last time I did some guitar porn, it was with this bass. Everybody's like, well, could we hear how it sounds? Well, I got to tell you, this thing sounds awesome. So what I'm going to do, I'm not, I'm not focusing down on my nuts, but I'm going to just kind of, like, zoom, 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 zoom the camera down, zoom the camera down, zoom the camera Well, I'm actually just lowering the elevation of the camera, but more so you can see my, my beautiful... Gibson Les Paul Money Base. So let me adjust this. I gotta loosen that. Too many freaking axes on this damn tripod. All right. Anyway, here it is. And you know, I, I don't want you looking at my at my crotch, but this thing is absolutely beautiful. Okay. And uh, you can see my floor and everything. Doesn't matter. Anyway, it's just some stuff here. I got some holsters and a knife. You know, I've been doing a lot of a lot of. Uh, a lot of gun stuff but anyway this bass like i said is beautiful it's got the dips and pickups and oh my god is this thing loud so i'm just going to give you a, a a quick a quick demonstration okay all right this bass this is this bass with everything on okay everything's completely up it's got three knobs volume volume tone okay That's just a standard riff. That's a song by my good friend Rich uh, up in Vermont. I know he's going to watch this one. So I always tell him I play that as my demo riff just because it's so beautiful. And it's so, uh, how do you say, I'm having a little, little, little drinky winky here. This is uh, my 10th Mountain Division uh, pint glass with uh, vodka and tang, actually. I was doing some gun porn videos, I guess, or gun videos before. And I ended up with like an hour's worth of freaking footage uh, talking about guns. And I was just like, dude, why don't you just talk for 10 minutes about what people care about in this world right now? What they need is some guitar porn. So anyway, Gibson Les Paul Money Base, brief overview. This is the one I got. I don't know. I think this is like a 2000, whatever it is, 2009. I've, it's in the last video. I don't even know. I got so many goddamn guitars. I love this because... The, really, the strap pin pins into like, you know, here's 12, 13, 14, 15, 6. It pins in at the 16th fret, whereas like a Rick pins in at the 12th. So this bass is just really cool looking because, you know, the neck sticks out so far. Um, you know, and I'm just letting you look at this bass because this is, you know, guitar porn. 
Um, and I was trying to play uh, Peace Sells But Who's Buying, but it's, I, I can't, really can't do without a pick, and I don't have one. If I, there should be a million on my desk, I'm sure, but all I have is beer bottle caps and, you know, I don't know, 300 blackout bullets, you know. Maybe I can play it with the 300 blackout bullets. just invented a new wrong way of playing the bass guitar anyway this thing is so big and beautiful and right now you're hearing it through my camera speakers i mean i got my camera set up here looking at this bass and i'm coming through you know my mesa um 400 plus you know and uh it's not the, the dials on this thing have not been reset in two or three years so if you remember the rickenbacker video where i went That's the riff I'm going to use to compare everything. Now, here's both pickups on with the tone control to zero. And like I said, that's my reference Rick. Rip, Rick. Sorry. Riff. I'm really drunk right now because I've been sucking these suckers down since I put the guns away. I couldn't wait to put the guns away so I could start touching my guitars. It's the only thing that makes me feel good anymore. Oh my God, everything going on in this world is making me feel like I just want to, I don't know, puke myself. Um, you know, judges throwing hairdressers in jail to feed their kids. What the hell? You know what? I just want to ask you all. Oh, what the hell is going on in this world when some judge throws some beautiful blonde woman to I think she's pretty hot. Of course, she's married or I'd be hitting on her, but whatever. You know me. Evil eye. You know me. Prepare to die. You know me. The snake bite kiss. The devil's grip. The iron fist. I figure if I'm not getting monetized anyway, I might as well use as many copyright infringements as I possibly can at one time. Considering this is guitar porn, I got to tell you what. Guitar porn with Uncle Robbie is the most fun you can have with your pants on. And my pants are on at this point because um, I just walked in from outside. I got to tell you, the snow's coming down like a son of a bitch. It's like May, what is it? Oh my God, it's May 9th. T you know, tomorrow's Mother's Day, okay? And right now I got like three inches of snow on the ground in front of my house. No bullshit. I just walked outside to get this guitar cord because I just broke my other one. So I have to get a, uh, you know, a guitar cord out of my car because I just keep all my crap in the car. And I actually should take it out because I really haven't played in about two... It's going to be two months next... next Actually, on Thursday that I haven't played out and or rehearsed or anything. You know, so it's just amazing. Anyway, don't want to bore you too much with this. Can I just smoke? So you know what the bass looks like. I'm going to tell you what it sounds like. Okay, so that was... This is... Step up, Rich. I can't remember my own licks. Well, actually, they're not my licks. They're someone else's licks. But I know his song is better than he does. So, whatever. Um, so that's that's the tone control off. Okay. Now this is tone all the way up with just the bridge pickup. so good i'm gonna actually put black electric tape on the back of this one and i'm gonna play this from now on because i just love this thing so much i'm not gonna live much longer and i think i look really cool playing it and it's the blue shirt that i'm wearing right now well it's just the one that i picked out of the laundry basket this morning and i put it on doesn't matter okay so that's that's the that's the neck with the uh tone control all the way up here's tone all the way up the way 
it farts. This bass, you need to keep the tone all the way up. You can't cut the bass on this. You got to keep... This is meant to be played balls out, treble up, all the way. Okay, I'm going to turn the treble pickup off. You know, the bridge pickup. Bridge, they used to call this the treble pickup and this the bass pickup. Now they call it the bass and the neck. They used to call it treble and bass. Whatever. Who cares? They change everything as time goes on. You know, I won't even get into... Oh, God. You know, things... Anyway, this is just the neck pickup. And that's my jack cracking. Sorry. Okay, now, now guys, I'm going to try my Rickenbacker 4003S, okay? Now, mind you, I just tweaked this one out. I did a video of it, and after I did that video, I put it back in its case, okay? And that case actually didn't go really anywhere that I wasn't, sat right next to my bed, okay? For, since the last video I did, it's been in its case, and let me show you what happened with this one, okay? Okay, you hear that beautiful big roundy? This is with all, both pickups on, both volumes. You love that? Don't you love that? The way that neck is fucking bowed? That's why Rick and Backers suck. Two truss rods, you can never get them adjusted right. For any, and especially if you live in a place that actually has different kinds of weather. I mean, I really wish I could move to, like, New Mexico. Because less, you know, shit there is always like 0% or 5% humidity. Here we go from 95% humidity to like 25% humidity in a day. So that's why Rickenbacker suck is unless you have 100 freaking guitar techs on your side with truss rod wrenches, these things suck. And this is, I love you, but you know what? You suck. The Les Paul bass has been sitting in my goddamn closet. For, I, well, I, I took it out to do that video that I did last time. And then I put it back in its case and it sat on my floor right here since then. So whenever that video was put up, you know, I don't even remember, a couple of months ago probably. Um, it's been sitting there. So uh, let, me, let me move this up though. Never played it up here, so let me try and figure it out. Sorry, I'm still screwing up. this thing i really got to find my wrench which i can't it's usually right on my desk probably in the guitar case i don't know whatever i could care less um love these things but you know what they fucking suck okay um so what's next i don't know i have to do something got to make this a good guitar porn video maybe i'll compare the gibson to another gibson <gasps> that would be an idea okay guys Next bass is my Gibson SG limited edition bass. Then you, the SG cover is not there because, you know, I got to keep tweaking the truss rod on this one also. But small price to pay for perfection. Now, this one is a beautiful bass. Let, let me show that flame. Look at that flame on there. Okay. This is not some type of film they put on a bass guitar. This is actually a half thickness. It's not just the top. It's a half thickness 
maple top, mahogany back, mahogany neck, Grover tuners, and that's my snark there because I just had to tune up. Um, it's got the old EBO mud bucker pickup plus the treble pickup. Here's the, the three point bridge. This, I think, I'm really going to change out and put a hip shot on. Um, you know, I've got to go up and see Josh up in interlocking, but anyway. So I'm going to do a quick comparison because comparing a Gibson to a Rickenbacker is like comparing, you know, mom's apple pie with tripe, okay? Not dissing Ricks, but you know what? They do suck. They serve their purposes, but they do suck in their stock configurations. So anyway, I'm going to play... A couple of things on this, okay? And I'm going to do a whole video about this bass, okay? Just because guitar porn is so important to me and all my friends. I love porn since the shutdown. I've been doing nothing but watching porn, YouTube, and pretty much, you know, Fox News, CNN, MSNBC, and Comedy Central. And that's about it. That's all that's been on my television for a long time. So anyway, I'm going to play this one, and then I'm going to, I'm going to do the riff again. On this bass, and I'm gonna, um, it's gonna be hard for me to splice it together. But for you guys, because I love you, because you've suffered with me through all the bullshit that I put you through for the last few months, I'm gonna just get back to doing guitar videos and fuck everything else. You know what I'm saying? That was that was everything full up. Now I'm going to turn the turn the tone control off. It's got volume volume tone just like the Les Paul bass. God damn thing. I hate it. Why does equipment always fail me? Right? You know, God damn. There you go. Oh man, I gotta, I gotta deox these jacks. These things have literally been sitting in my in my closet, you know. Rob in the closet, like on South Park. Tom Cruise is in the closet. Now I got my gun! You know, I don't know if you remember that episode of Star, uh, South Park, you know, with, um, you know, Tom Cruise and, and John Travolta, you know, and then, and then, uh, what's his name shows up with his gun, you know, the rap guy, I don't know, whatever, sitting here having a bunch of drinks, because, you know, <sighs> it's Mother's Day, and my mother's in Tennessee in a nursing home, probably laying in her own shit, because... No one's seen her in months. Nobody's actually been able to go in there and check on her. So, you know, those big, fat-ass goddamn nurses' aides, probably just like, yeah, she's at the room at the end of the hall. Leave her there. Can't wait to go see my mother next time. Check her ass for dermal ulcers. Whatever. I know. Anyway. So, back to this bass guitar. Okay? Um, okay. I turned the volume... Controls up, tone control all the way up. Now I'm going to shut off the bridge pickup, the treble pickup, as we called it back in the olden days. I'm going to just play it on the bass pickup. Man, it's Jack. It's the plug that's it's the plug that's bad actually. All right, I'm going to shut off the treble pickup just on the bass pickup. Rich is going to love this one. mud bucker pickup because they say it's muddy it's only muddy if you turn the volume control off i'm gonna turn the i'm not the volume sorry the tone control off
okay? Okay, this is the Gibson Les Paul money base with everything on and everything up. Tone control all the way up, just bridge pickup. Next, next, tone control completely off. Treble pickup, tone all the way up. Okay, next, tone control all the way up, both pickups, okay, bridge pickup. Okay, guys, so that's this video. Tell me in the comments, leave me in the comments, which one did you like better? The Gibson SG bass or the Gibson Les Paul Money bass? Because, you know, they both sound better than that piece of shit fucking Rickenbacker that sucks. No matter what I can do to it, Rickenbackers never stop sucking. Anyway, that'll be the uh, subtitle of this video. Love you guys. Keep on rocking in the free world, yeah!